Hi everyone, I'm Whitney and I post sewing, crafting, and cooking videos here on my YouTube channel. My husband and I kind of try to challenge ourselves to do at least one meatless meal a week and that's because meat is typically the most expensive ingredient in a meal and it also is just a little fun to change things up. And so today I'm going to show you how to make spinach lasagna rolls. They are meatless and they are delicious. You will need a glass baking dish, a large can of spaghetti sauce, nine lasagna noodles, spinach, either one can or a 16 ounce box of frozen spinach, Parmesan cheese, two eggs, a block of mozzarella cheese, and fresh or canned mushrooms are optional, but they make it a heartier meal. Start by boiling water in a large pot or deep skillet, then place your noodles in. In a large bowl, start to combine your ingredients. First, the block of cheese that's shredded, then add salt, pepper, and any other seasonings you want along with the two eggs. Drain the spinach and mushrooms and add them along with a generous shake of the Parmesan cheese. Grab a spoon and mix everything together. When the noodles have cooked most of the way, remove them and place onto a clean towel. When they are cool enough to handle, place one in your greased baking dish and place some of the filling into it, then roll it up. Repeat for the other eight. If you have any filling left, just spoon it around the rolls. Then cover them with the spaghetti sauce. Preheat your oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit and bake for 30 to 40 minutes. And we like to eat ours with uh, green beans and some garlic bread. I have made these several times and we love them. They are really delicious and this recipe makes enough for Jeremiah and I to eat for dinner for two nights and they reheat really great. Click like and share if you enjoyed this recipe and let me know in the comments below if you want to see more cooking videos. And I also have a link in the description box if you want to see all the other cooking tutorials I have done in the past. And I will see everyone again soon with some more tutorials. Bye!